And this one, this is my old dojo where I used to teach karate. And this was 1997, 98, and that were good times. I think Wayne Batty, I think you might remember this place. I'm not sure if you taught it here or not, mate, but yeah, we had some good times here, buddy. Teaching karate and that. And what else? I don't really have much memories around here. Um, got that long causeway over there, which is still a tad scary, to be quite honest with you. Um, I actually won't walk up there myself <laughs> on a on a night time. Then again, it used to be more scary because we had Field Dead Hospital and all the uh, mental patients used to wander about on that alleyway. And it could be quite a scary experience especially as a kid and what have you. <coughs> I think my mate Goddess, he had an experience up there once. One uh, mental patient he walked out and he just jumped in front of the Goddess and was shouting, Penny, Penny, give me a penny. And I think Goddess just, I think Goddess just basically said, freak off, basically. I can't swear, obviously, for group. Hmm. Yeah, not much to, not really much to talk about around here. You know, it's quite posh and awakening. You know, as kids, we were never really part of this. Apart from the only times I used to come up here were for hospital when I brought my arm on Tarzans and what have you. As a kid, we used to make this journey quite a lot, me and my mum. Hmm. Yeah, we're just approaching Long Causeway now, uh, on the right hand side, for those that know it. Spooky, spooky place. That used to be. But as I mentioned, it's all changed now. No more mental hospital, so yeah, that's it. Long Causeway. And then down here, this is where, no not down there, I think it's next one. No it's not, rewind, back again. Yeah down here is basically where there's kids, well kids 18, so, well actually I was 17, my first drink I had in town. Um, but we used to come up here, I thought a club at the end of this road were called uh, there's a lot you may remember, called it New York Bar. And yeah, it was like a, well, it was like a gay, a gay club really, but all the straight lads used to go in no problem. Never got any hassle off them or out like that, off, off those who were that way inclined. And it was just a good night. Lots of uh, happy faces, women, booze, smokes, and a kebab. Morning. And that was pretty much the be all and end all of it, really. 80s, 90s, early 70s. Some of you might remember New York Bar. And also, at the end of this road is um, this is where the first gym I ever went to as well. And that was um, Light Waves, which a lot of you know of, but that shut down to make way for the Sun Lane <coughs> of the road from me. Yeah, but this place hasn't really changed at all. It's still pretty much, as you can see, it's still like, you know, that street still looks like 70s. Nothing's changed at all. You know, litter on floor. You know, a mess and everything. Yeah, it's just character. It's what gives this place character, really. And then the end of this road is where all posh people live. And it's amazing how they live so close side by side. Yeah, it's interesting. Uh -oh. 
Yeah, I'm just going to go up to New York by now. Um, I think it's... Is it closed? Is it knocked down? I can't remember. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed it, guys. I mean, what's that? I mean, what's the point in that? What's that all about? That statue. What will that cost council? 40 grand, 50, 50,000 quid. Could have quite easily gone to our nurses, firemen. The actual emergency services will need it. It's just a robin. And I'm not going to get on about Wiki Council because they're proper like, oh, I'm getting a rant and I don't want to do that. I'm out here having a walk, just exercising these old knees of mine because they're knackered. And just, yeah, I'm trying to give you guys a bit of a insight into Wiki. Not that, not, not, not that any of you don't know what I'm talking about here because you've all, you've all done this, but just nice to bring it all back and I'll give you some memories yeah talking a bit